Representative White. Thank you very much, uh, Mr. Speaker. And uh, I also rise to speak to the um, 104th report of the Public Works Committee into Blackwood High School and, and thank the work for the committee and for the member Carvel in his diligent matter that he, that he seeks to uh, make sure that these projects are, uh, um, are put through his committee in a, in a timely fashion because um, investing in our education is so important. And uh, once again, this uh, new $9.4 million investment in Blackwood High School is so welcomed by the community. It comes on the back of um, recent STEM investments in facilities in the last couple of years, but this, but this new almost $10 million investment in public infrastructure in our public school system is so welcome, and indeed is going to set up the school um, very well into the future. It, it will help uh, facilitate the increase in capacity of students to up to uh, some 1,400 uh, by the end of uh, 2022 as Year 7s uh, transition to high school. And I know that the pilot programs throughout my whole community, especially down at Mitcham Girls, are, are going exceedingly well. Um, the new facilities are going to include uh, new uh, classrooms, um, including uh, specialising in art, technology, dance, health and physical education. And Blackwood High School, uh, Mr Speaker, as you may be aware, has a fantastic uh, uh, senior level uh, dance program. Um, we're going to see a new uh, staff amenities, uh, which is so important. And, and like so many schools throughout metropolitan Adelaide, Blackwood High School is one of those uh, classic 1960 builds. So having the new facilities is so important. Uh, refurbishment of toilet facilities and of course some uh, extensions to the Home Economic Centre as well. Um, but the project is expected to be finished uh, later this year, which is, uh, which is an incredibly uh, handy for the school. Um, and Blackwood High School really is one of the flagship um, uh, schools in my community. Uh, it has had uh, some fantastic graduates over many, many years who've, uh, who've attended uh, that high school and it continues to uh, excel in its uh, academic um, um, results. It excels in the students that it produces, the, the leaders of tomorrow in our, in our school. So I would just like to, to thank uh, Principal Sharon Goldman, who's on leave this, uh, this term, and, and Acting Principal Jason Loke, uh, the new uh, Chair of the Governing Council, Matthew Cheshire, and the, and the great work of, that the parents do on the Governing Council to, to meet the requirements there. And just like to give a good uh, a bit of a plug to um, uh, Zach Washington, who's a Year 11 uh, student at uh, Blackwood High School, who recently competed in the State Track and Field Championships um, in February this year. Uh, he competed in six events, and uh, Zach came first in the under-20 3,000-metre steeplechase, under-20 javelin, second in under-20 discus, uh, under-20 pole vault, and under-20 400 metres, and came fourth in the long jump. So watch out for Zach. I reckon he might be representing Australia in the Olympics in, uh, in years to come. But uh, a wonderful project, and uh, I look forward to, uh, to seeing the final product later this year.